Welcome to the testing world. Previously we have seen what is environment and how we can work on environment. Now I'll show you how we can work on environment by coding. So I'm just moving to Postman and previously we have seen we can define different environments and we can set different key and values specific to the environment. Now I want to show you how we can work on any environment by coding. So first is we have a postman object with the help of which we are going to call a method with the name set environment variable. So I'm saying I'm going to pre request script before sending my request. I want to set one more environment variable. So I'm saying postman dot set environment variable and what is the name of the variable you want to give so I want to give like my ID and what ID Welcome you want to, to store it word. so that must be in the string format session, whatever the data you are storing into functions. the environment or the or the global so functions that should be in the string format so I'm giving code, value like which is used to perform some specific value. task okay I give you I'm just running it okay when once executed I'm just Many going to manage environment. My environment was UAT. Again so I select again. it. And if you Example see, could be a variable is a created shot. with the name so it might my be ID. In different test cases, you need to take a screenshot. So here we have seen we so can set writing that code any environment again, value at the runtime by into a using the postman object and, and the method name is that function set wherever environment required. variable. So functions. Is I'm just commenting code? out this. Maybe so we have seen first option. Code which is reusable Next again is. And again, we, we can get that code into the any environment ver value at the runtime and the wherever approach is same so i'll show you how we can i'm writing like postman dot we have the different kind of functions one is environment is any argument variable and, any and what is the variable name so i'm setting like we can url the functions and what you want to do argument, so i just want to display value. on the console previously and we have seen one which so is taking console dot log so i'll explain you what do you mean by the return value code now I'm sending so this request all, again and I'm this is a pre-request script which is which going, is going to execute before sending the request. And so as I execute this, I'm just moving, I'm to, just moving to the console and if you check it here, I'm just that's my URL because we want to print here. URL. I have a new file. I'm going to save so it. here we have seen how we can so set environment variable by coding, file, so how we can get environment variable by I'm coding itself. I'm just commenting it as well. JS. It's a JavaScript yeah. file. So next is Here I want to, to clear any environment variable. Function. I'm just moving to the postman again and writing Without like argument and return postman value. Dot so no argument and no return value. Here I'm going to create environment. A so here in JavaScript, if you want variable. to variable, the syntax is very simple. What is the name of the variable? Function. It's and name. So I'm, I'm giving, giving the name, environment hello. variable name and that's is body. username. So whatever the code. So you one thing that need to be noticed clear means it, it is going to delete that like environment variable. I'm okay, I'm sending a request. Dot write. Once request is sent, this I'm just going to the manage environment on the UAT, and you will see username environment variable is removed. Function. So console dot in the same way if you want right, to remove so all environment variables okay keyword, I'm just commenting out this if I want to remove all environment variables so I can use no postman dot and no clear return environment variables I'm not giving any variable name I'm just saying so one function clear all created. the environment environment now, variables we I'm just going to send a request calling it as of now. and again if everything Call goes fine function, I'm going to the manage environment right that's my UAD environment Bracket. and here we Means have we, we don't have any function. variable now because all the so variables are removed a simple JavaScript file in which we so here we have seen we calling that function and here how we can we work it, on environment variables name, by using coding and, and for this task I'm using postman object so I want to execute which is a predefined object we are just we using it and calling different methods command prompt I'm on a command that's all we have for the session and from the command thanks for watching this video move to that location where your JavaScript file is placed so I'm moving here now and to execute that function I'm going to use node and the f and the file name which is function 1.js enter 
So you will notice we are getting answer this is my function and this is no argument and no return value. One more thing, one important thing that I want to display. If I'm not calling that function, I've just created this function, I'm not calling it. So if I execute, nothing will happen because you have the function but you did not call it. Function is going to execute when we are going to call it. If we don't call it, it's just a function, we are not calling it anywhere. So whenever we create a function, we need to call it and wherever we are calling, it will done. If I'm calling this function three times, so ultimately this function will execute three times and we will get total six lines in the output. So if I clear the screen and running it again, so we are getting total six lines because we are calling it three times. That's why we are creating function because if, if I want to perform any task again and again, rather than writing a, that code again and again, we are just calling that function. We are just writing the code in a function and calling wherever required. So here we have created function and calling it. So here in this session we have covered what is function and we have seen a very simple kind of function which is without argument and no return value as well. So that's all we have for this session. Thanks for watching this video.